I mean, that was pure magic. It's pretty life-changing when you do not have to enter passwords into your websites wherever you go anymore. So Creative Mornings is the community I wish existed when I moved to New York in 1999 and didn't know a soul here. And I couldn't really find the event series that was affordable enough for me for the little money I made at the time. In 2008, I started the first creative co-working community in New York City, and we called it Studio Mates at the time. And the, the concept was simple. Uh, invite people in that are also working in the creative field, that are kind and entrepreneurial, and then just see what happens. And what I realized is that real magic unfolds when you surround yourself with people with sort of similar values, good hearts, and that, you know, really believe that they can make a dent in the world. We're in 234 cities, gathering approximately 20,000 people a month, every month for free, hosted by about a thousand volunteers. It's a real engine of generosity. I luckily have people that are very operationally minded that work with me. And they eventually pointed out to me, Tina, sharing a spreadsheet is not the way to go, like with passwords on it. <laughs> I want to make these things, these I call them the admin things because I don't like them, as invisible as possible. If I don't have to worry about them, I know it's working and I'm happy. So that's where one password comes in. The fact that I never think about it just says so much how well it works. <laughs> Well, I originally started using it only for you know, my personal logins. And then it was a real game changer for me when we started using it for Creative Mornings and we had a vault that we could share within uh, my team before we shared is a Google spreadsheet. I know, it's not ideal, but that's what we did. And I'm sure a lot of small businesses do that. Anyone who works with me knows that I have really high standards in who I partner with and work with at Creative Mornings. And I was really happy when I started hearing about the leadership at 1Password. And I think it's not a given that people that run a tech company are heart-centered and community-minded humans. So as we are in this 15-year history moment with Creative Mornings, we kind of go back to the roots of like why I started this. It's really about honoring and celebrating creativity and reminding everyone that we, we inherently are creative.